How does your spine get nutrition? Cerebrospinal fluid is what bathes your brain, the brain stem and the spinal cord. And it's that flow of cerebrospinal fluid throughout the nervous system that circulates nutrition to the discs and the spinal segments and the spinal cord and the brain. But that cerebrospinal fluid is essential to carry away waste and toxins from those very same areas. Now the flow of cerebrospinal fluid through the spinal segments is called imbibition. So imbibition is that really minute expansion and contraction and pressure on the vertebral segments and the disc. And this micro movement is like an accordion and that provides that circulation of cerebrospinal fluid through the disc there to keep that really, really healthy. Now, what we depend on for that process of imbibition is movement. So if we're not getting enough movement throughout the day because of sedentary lifestyles, sitting at computers all day, or being subluxated and having a fixated joint segment that can and will affect the flow of cerebrospinal fluid throughout your entire nervous system there. And that will accelerate degenerative changes in the spine and the disc through here. The good news is you can absolutely optimize the flow of cerebrospinal fluid throughout your spine by increasing mobility. One, by making sure you're getting adjusted regularly. Two, you're not sitting too much. And if you are sitting, sitting smartly, using uh, sitting aids such as a wobble cushion and kneeling chair or using a stand-up desk. So there you go. There's some take-home tips that you can use straight away to keep your spine healthier and happier.